Hey, welcome to section 3.3. Um, in this section, we're going to be discussing even and odd functions and functions that are increasing, decreasing, and constant. Um, so we'll start off with discussing the some symmetry that we've talked about before. So remember, a graph has y-axis symmetry if it looks this looks the same when you fold it over the y-axis. Um, so the graph of y equals x squared plus 1 is one such function that has y-axis symmetry. And remember that we can classify y, we can check if a graph has y-axis symmetry if y equals x squared plus 1 is on graph, then so is y equals negative x squared plus 1. And that squared should be outside the parentheses. And so this idea holds in functions as well. Um, and that's where we get the idea of even functions. We say um, a function f is even if f of x equals y implies f of negative x equals y. And so we can then check that the function f of x equals x squared plus 1 is even since f of negative x equals negative x squared plus 1, which is the same as x squared plus 1, which is f of x. And so if we think about it, this is really just the same property um, that we had for symmetry on a graph. So if a function is even, then it has symmetry about the y-axis. So that's generally how we think about even functions. If we can check if, if we know what an even function is, then we know what it looks like by just graphing the positive values. In the same way that when we knew when we knew the graph of this, so the positive half of y equals x squared plus 1, then we get the negative half by just reflecting it across the y-axis. Um, next, we're going to discuss a similar property. Um, we had even, so maybe you can guess what the other function, other kind of function is called, odd functions. Um, even and odd, they go together. And so remember, we have symmetry about the origin. If we graph y equals x cubed on the positive side, that looks something like this. And on the negative side, remember, we reflect it across this line uh, or rotate it 90 degrees or sorry, rotate it 180 degrees um, to get that the bottom half looks like that. Huh. 
Sorry, I'm having a bit of technical difficulties with my Apple Pencil. Well, we're going to stop there for this video. I'll figure out um, my pencil and we'll pick it up in a third video.